the gay boule. Okay. We have the gay boule, the gay black political scene, and gay Hollywood. Mm-hmm. What do you know about that right there, brother? I would like for you to well, take the time. Well, first of all. Hold up. Mm-hmm. I would like for you to take the time <laughs> and to explain it to our audience about what is the gay boule. I'll go into that. What is the gay political well, scene? Well, I'll use this as the springboard. Two things going on here. Now, this guy here is undoubtedly gay. But here goes the white people again. Obviously, this has to be a personal picture. That's right. Uh, one that is not supposed to be used on the front cover of a newspaper when two people died. See, despite what you think about this guy here doing the shooting, another guy died in the context of this which just so happened to be good friends with this guy. And which leads us to that whole political part I'll get into in a few minutes of where there's already been made mention that this was a lover spat. But before I get into that, I want to get into this particular part. What does it tell you about the mindset of a people that had a horrendous death, two deaths? Yeah, horrendous death, two deaths, on July 23rd, which is key, that's the African New Year in ancient Kemet and the rising of Sirius. So we also have some type of conspiracy going on. I'll get into it in a few seconds. But I just want to talk about this. Why would they put this on the front page of the New, uh, 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 the New York Daily News? You see? This picture of a man here, you know what I'm saying, sporting some butt crack and some damn plastic yellow pants on. Because, see, they not only just talk about him. They That's talk right. about the black man, period. There you when go. they do things like that. They it's all a part of a propaganda of dehumanization. Right. Not dehumanizing the killer, That's but right. dehumanizing the black man and black people in general. That's right. They, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Now, another person died in the context of this, so why are you going to make mockery? in a certain condescending way the next day. Now, first of all, it was a ritual that's going down, and this is nothing but MK Ultra, the Manchurian candidate, where they can just give a person a phone call and he go and shoot up the place and kill this other congressman, uh, 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 councilman. James Davis. You see, kill this other councilman, and his middle name is Boaz, which is a Masonic symbol and a, and a Masonic genealogy of Boaz and a pillar, you see. And so they would do this, and they would put this type of thing on the newspaper, and the New York Daily World is supposed to be very serious, and they would put this type of thing on. This is not by mistake that they would do something like this, and uh, do something like this, and then they would show another picture of him, another picture of him, and this will let you know, okay, they say it was one picture, we got this picture with his shirt off. Well, why is it that the next picture they show him, he got his shirt off again? Which means they're trying to play on something that is going on. You see, his shirt is off again in this particular part, and he's all exposed. So this lets you know that they're trying to convey a certain thing, uh, a, a, a certain image and all, but, you know, but, and, um... But it's not by mistake. Why didn't they put this one on the cover? It's a lot decent. But I'm just trying to say this type thing here is still a ritual to make mockery. And we don't get it. We don't, we don't get this particular part. You see what I'm saying? But this dehumanizes both people. Because they are also insinuating that this was a lover spat. Also, and it very well could have been. But this is how they do things based on this, but it's also still going back, now you got to understand, that why did it happen on July 23rd, which is in case the African rising of Sirius, the star Sirius, and the African New Year for most uh, uh, ancient, uh, of the ancient world, and the New Year for, for, for people in the ancient world, period. But not only that, remember, and I've been saying this since 98, that you must understand that whenever they do this during the summer solstice, it is for distraction. Whenever this happens during the summer solstice, it is always due to distraction. The, the, the Abner Luima thing happened during the summer solstice. 
This is always for a distraction. When they would put this type of uh, 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 this aspect on, it's just like this Kobe Bryant thing. We'll get into in a few minutes. Is nothing but distraction. Why did these? Why did they sentence him during the summer solstice? Because they know that during the summer solstice, let me explain out there for the people who don't understand, that black people are closer to not only the star Sirius, but the cosmos, but the production of melanin is at a higher level during the summer months. It's a rebirth of the human spirit, period. And so black people have the highest form of melanin. They have to put certain things that give you a conversation so you can be locked into foolishness so that you can miss some certain things. Because remember now, if the radio station all goes off, somebody might start to think, start to think. So this is a form of propaganda, which leads us now back to the gay thing. We know now that the Boule, which is a black elite society, started by the Skull and Bones at Yale, in a black elite society, the Boule, which is the people who basically are chosen by the United States government to, or the Illuminati, let's put it that way, or the secret society, to run the black neighborhood, whether it be Afrocentric consciousness, whether it be civil rights all stuff, whether it be Bible Belt gospel or whatever they have infiltrated all forms of society, the Boule, uh, Sigma Pi Phi fraternity, and basically, Tom inspire on the black community and make sure that we are always at a deficit when it comes to getting ahead. We are marginalized when it comes to rising to our own aspect because we always have this infiltration and this agent community that is not uh, 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 someone that's infiltrated amongst the grassroots, but the very heads of policymakers. So when you say the boule, the boule is like the black elite? Yes. The black elites that tried to prevent black people from prospering. Exactly. Okay. I uh, exactly. And if, and, and if, if, and whatever time that black, saying, and, 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 okay. and whatever, and when it, whenever we do get some crumbs, it is always guided and controlled by the Europeans, and they make sure that we don't govern our own selves. Mm -hmm. You see, even when we think we're making a decision, the boule, it, and, and the government is behind that, because the first rule in the tech, Occult Technology of Power, which is the Illuminati Handbook, is always be a part of all groups, fund everything. We fund the radical and the conservative. So even the most radical, a lot of times, have infiltration and can be backed by the same ruling powers because they really don't care because they're a secret society. So they even fund the radical. This is a form of mind control. So the boule, but what? is the code and the key that will keep a people year after year for the, since it's been established in the early 1900s to keep these particular people in secrecy to the point that we only hear about them in the 90s and they continue to do these things that is because they go under the same level who, of the people who started them, which is the skull and bones, which is the same ritual, whereas you have to have sexual intercourse with the other man, and that is your secret. That is the thing of yours. The La Costa Nostra, when they say this thing of ours, is the word for La Costa Nostra, this thing of ours. Well, what is this thing of ours? You are sworn to secrecy because of a homosexual act. So... This is why it's so ingrained and rooted on such a higher level because I fuck you in the ass and therefore I always have this on you. And so therefore our secret, you see, can always stand. Now and remember now, this is not a out with a gay homosexual reign whereas you, you know, homosexual reign whereas you gay and somebody screwed you and, everybody, and you're out of the closet. There's no secrecy in that. These are for upstanding members of society, so on, quote unquote, that stand to lose everything because of the families, because of the whole social order, if somebody found out that they're gay. You see, usually these people are supposed to be the ultimate form of the virile male executing this fake falsehood power in these movements.